Let's discuss after uh, chapter 4. Let us discuss chapter 1, which is about administration. So, this is about six pages uh, with the section uh, 100, meaning chapter 1, 00, zero section 00. Zero zero. It is about requirement of permit. So, this code provides that a services of registered licensed master plumber shall be enlisted in accordance with the plumbing law of the Philippines. Plumbing law is what, as I have written a while ago, that is RA 1378. Okay. So, it shall be unloadful for any other person, company, or corporation, whether acting as principal or otherwise, to cause or to do or cause to be done any plumbing or drainage work. So it is uh, illegal for any other person to do that according to RA 1378. Okay? So actually, uh, they can be sued to court. So again, it necessitates acquiring of permit as required by this law from the office of building official. So that is the authority having jurisdiction within the local area. Okay, the uh, section 101, meaning chapter 1, 01. Okay. To whom permits may be issued? Of course, somebody should apply for permit and then that permit should be issued to that one applying for it. So any person, firm or corporation, to do or cause to be done any installation of plumbing work regulated by this code except to registered or licensed master plumber. Right. So the permit is actually issued to the master plumber. The permit is not issued to the owner. So it is different with regards to other profession. No? For example, civil engineers, electrical, mechanical, in the uh, engineering plan. Specifically, the permit is issued to licensed registered master planner. Holding a valid and expired. So, if you are registered master planner, but your license is expired, so it is also illegal. And uh, unrevoked. What is unrevoked? So, the uh, board of master planners can revoke fully your license for uh, reasonable grounds. For example, ethical issues. Para utangka, di ka nagbabayad. That is ethically correct. So, 
O kaya immoral act. So Those are the uh, conditions for which permits may be issued to somebody. And that somebody must be a registered master planner. So section 102, chapter 1, and section number 2. Application for permit. So it should be done by the by the uh, registered master planner to the office of building official. That is the usual way. That is the usual way. And uh, you'll notice what are the uh, documents that have to be uh, included in the application. Description of plumbing work that is uh, to be included in the application. Plumbing work to be covered by the permit. So write it down. Also, number two. Describe the land upon which the uh, proposed plumbing work is to be done. So describe the land, meaning state the uh, address and the uh, documents that uh, covered the ownership of the ownership of that uh, uh, area. So TCT, no? TCT is required. So, and then indicate the use or occupancy, meaning. Is that residential in nature? Is that commercial in nature? Is that industrial in nature? So describe it. Be accompanied by plans, drawings, diagrams, computation, including computation. So computation is not required on the uh, engineering plan or engineering blueprint, but on separate sheets, short but paper. Those are required with computation. Huh? Simultaneously submitted with the engineering drawing and plan. Okay? Give such other data and information as required by the administrative authority. Data and information meaning specification, those uh, precaution, legends, okay? So those are additional data. Be signed by owner or permittee. Okay, owner should be able to agree uh, to the project. So it is uh, the owner who demand the uh, registered master plumber for the project and therefore the master plumber will design and afterwards the owner should conform to that design and uh, by signing the uh, design sheet. Okay? You'll notice that on the engineering plan there is a what? Owner, no? owner name and signature. Okay? Not only the uh, designer, owner and the, the OBU. Okay? So, uh, plans and specification are also necessary to be included, including bills of material. What is bills of material? The different materials used, and including amount of those corresponding materials and corresponding prices. Okay, per unit and therefore total cost. Okay, so sealed by. Signed in seal. Signed meaning your signature as a professional registered mechanical ah, master plumber and sealed. There is a, uh, I uh, think all of you know what is seal. Huh? Professional seal. There is a design for every profession in the Philippines. There is a design and that is uh, used as uh, what? Usually it is a uh, in a do document, it is uh, uh, put here, somewhere here, no? Lower left side portion, usually lower left side portion. So it is a uh, seal. Okay. So, next, uh, how many copies are to be prepared? So it is written on the law. How many? Six sets. So, Civil Engineering, National Building Code stated five copies. Five. National Building Code. Master Plumber, Law, six. Okay? Okay. Next, uh, information on plans and specification. What are those? Scale of the uh, drawing on the uh, tracing paper and shall be of sufficient...